I just officially finished my work day, which means this festive weekend has begun. Welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited for this weekend because I have just not felt in the Christmas spirit, which is so unlike me. Normally I'm so ready for Christmas. Honestly, I was more in the Christmas spirit this November than in the month of December. Clearly it's because we've moved. We've just had so much going on. So I think this weekend I just made the decision to redecorate for Christmas, even though it's only gonna be up for like four days because we're going out of town for Christmas. I don't know, I'm just ready for the Christmas spirit because last night we actually had a Christmas party with our small group. We had a gingerbread house competition and a family feud Christmas style. It was just so fun. And so I'm really excited to get in the Christmas spirit. So I'm just gonna bring you guys along with me on this weekend. We're not doing everything festive. We still have a lot of house stuff to get done. And honestly, I don't know exactly what we're doing this whole weekend, but I do know that tonight we're going to go to a breakout room with some friends. We're gonna decorate today. And then tomorrow we're gonna go see the new Spider-Man movie. I'm so excited. You guys know we love Marvel and I have high, high hopes for this movie. I love the Spider-Man movies from them. So I'm really excited for that. And then on Sunday, we actually have our church's like Advent service, which it's special because it's actually in the Buckhead Theater. If you know anything about Atlanta, it's a really nice theater. And it's just gonna be like a Christmas themed service. And I'm really excited for that. So I'll bring you guys along on everything this weekend. Normally I film weekdays. So weekends is gonna be a little new glimpse into my life for sure. So before we get started with all of the festivities and decorating, I want to think back Babbel for sponsoring today's video. So if you haven't heard me talk about Babbel, I love them. They are a great language learning app. They also have a website and they have so many languages to choose from. I specifically chose Spanish because my husband is Hispanic, which many of you guys know that. There's so many reasons why I love Babbel. I have a very busy lifestyle, so I love that they have lessons that are under 10 minutes. And not only are they short, but they're really, really great. They teach real and practical situations. And the lessons are designed by real language teachers, not some artificial intelligence. So you know it's really good. And I love that they have so many different ways to learn. I prefer to learn in their live classes, which you have like a small group with a real language teacher that is there walking you through the lessons, but they have other ways to learn like podcasts, games, videos, and then the short 10 minute lessons. So if you guys are wanting a new year's resolution for 2022, I highly recommend trying to learn a language. It's been fun the past couple of months I've been doing it and I really want to up my game in 2022. That's my new year's resolution is to learn Spanish better than I already do. If you guys want to check out Babbel, you can actually get up to 60 5% off and a 20 day money back guarantee, which is great. So if you don't love it, you're guaranteed your money back. I promise you will love it though. But you guys can check out the links in the description box for all that information. And thank you again to Babbel for sponsoring today's video. I'm going to get started on my quick 10 minute lesson. I'll probably show you guys a little glimpse because I think it's so fun. Perdón, hablas inglés. Ella habla italiano. Yo hablo español. And just like that, I'm done with my lesson. It always goes by so fast and I genuinely enjoy it. So definitely check out Babbel with the links down below. Sam should be off work any minute and then we'll start decorating for Christmas. I'm gonna go get the stuff out of the basement while I'm waiting. So Sam just got off of work. We just got the Christmas stuff from the basement. I'm going to make some hot cocoa, maybe our Christmas cookies. <laughs> Why are you laughing? I just feel like no one says hot cocoa. <laughs> People say hot chocolate. Oh. <laughs> Hot cocoa. Whatever. From the cacao pod. <laughs> We're getting in the Christmas spirit, okay? Hey Siri, play Michael Bublé's Christmas album. Christmas Deluxe 10th Anniversary Edition by Michael Bublé now playing.
we just finished decorating the Christmas tree. We just got dressed. Well, Sam just got dressed. I'm saying the same thing because we're going to go meet our friends for dinner and then we're going to a breakout room. We are so excited. We love breakout rooms. Saturday morning our first Saturday in this house and it's been super cozy it's been raining pretty much all morning like cloudy and like slightly raining Sam actually went for a run and it started raining on him but he's outside right now because the Home Depot people are here and they're actually bringing us our washer and dryer today yay so we can finally do wash we're really excited we got a really good like black friday deal on them today we don't have many plans we are actually going to see spider-man the new movie tonight which we are so excited for i've been watching all the interviews but i haven't spoiled it or anything i think we're just gonna have a chill saturday it's super cozy in here guys last night was so much fun we did a breakout room at 10 which was really late so like we went to dinner then we went back to our friend's house and then we went to the battery to go to the breakout game or what is it breakout i don't know but it is the best if you live in atlanta or live near atlanta you need to go that was really fun but it did definitely affect me because we stayed out so late because it started at 10 and then it ended at 11 and then we got back pretty late at like 11 30 12 and you guys know i never even stay up that late let alone stay out that late and I just like feel it this morning like I'm just really tired even though we slept until 8 I'm still tired and I feel like it's just from staying up because I'm not used to that but anyway you guys don't care about that so let's get this day started I am really hoping our washer and dryer will be done here soon so I can show you guys because I'm so excited okay if you can hear that it is pouring outside and we got a package of the rest of our bar stools that we ordered so Sam is taking those out, but the box is soaking wet. So he's just like taking it out of the box and bringing them inside. Okay, apparently they finished putting our washer and dryer in. Yay, those look so nice. They really do. <gasps> I was surprised wow. when I saw them. I'm like, dang, we got some pretty good stuff. We got a great deal on these. My camera died in the middle of Sam assembling the bar stools, but it gets worse because look, I ordered the wrong size. This is for like a actual bar stool. These are counter stools. It's too tall compared to the rest. And here's the even worse part. They don't sell those counter like height stools except for in a set of three and we need one. So I don't know what we're gonna do. I'm gonna make us lunch now. I'm gonna do eggs and avocado toast. <laughs> We've been just relaxing a little bit. I made some tea and we just got another package which is like the shelves that I bought for inside or like not shelves, like drawers, like dresser drawers, but it's not a dresser, it's like bins is a better way to put it for our closet. So we'll see if it works. Sam really wants to have the dresser be in the room. We just put it in there, I'll show it to you once he's done with this. I think it's too bulky, but that's my opinion. So we'll see how the closet works. So either we'll keep the dresser in the room 
or we'll build this dresser and put it in the closet and see which option we like better. So we just built that. This is our dresser that we had in our apartment and it's pretty tight in here um, with it. It's not the worst thing in the world, but definitely didn't want it in here. So we're gonna see if this works right and we know in this that corner. Be a little biased. Just a little. She doesn't want that. Thing I don't want that here. But I am fine with it. It's just so big. I guess it's not bad. <laughs> but what can fit in there? That's the big question. Well, let's try. So we just tried to fit all of our clothes in these bins and it's a major no-go. I guess we're gonna unload all our clothes in the dresser. We've officially finished putting everything in the closet. We put all of the shoes there and normally our racks are full, but I decided to throw like any special occasion shoes in a bin. And I feel like that was so smart because now we have so much more room, like any major heels or anything. I hung up my jeans. Um, so yeah, we're sticking with this in here for now. But turns out that we need to leave like right now to go to the movies. Um, because it's already like four o'clock. Well, I guess we've got time. We've got like 15 minutes till we need to go. So we'll give you a review after it's over. We won't spoil anything and hopefully we'll be really happy. Whoa. He's been inspired. Whoa. Okay, I will say that that was the most exciting throughout movie. Mm, it was exciting. Like, we're just happy. Yeah, I'm left really happy uh -huh. after that movie. And sometimes with Marvel, I get like, I'll leave a movie, like Eternals. Didn't care. No, I yeah. fell asleep, which you is did. terrible. It is actually only like 8.30. Which I got home and I was like, all right, like we're getting in bed. Nope. Yeah. So what are we going to do? Watch Survivor? We're going to watch Survivor. Tomorrow we've got our church's Advent service and then we're going to get the Christmas spirit. We haven't planned what we're going to do, but I think we're going to go look at Christmas lights and things like that mm. and just get in the Christmas spirit. Do it. Good night. It is Sunday morning and it is our church's like Advent service. This is my first service going to it because we weren't here last year. So I'm so excited. And Sam is actually a part of like the team that sets up the church. So he has been gone since seven this morning setting up. Um, so I'm going to drive there, meet him there. I'm trying to leave early because parking in cities really stresses me out. Like trying to figure out where to park because nothing ever really has like designated parking so i'm gonna get there a little bit early hopefully i can get a meter because i know it's free on sundays but we'll see so that's why i'm in a bit of a rush i have my to-go coffee i'm gonna grab my bible my jacket and head out the door So 
we just finished at the church service. It was so great. I've never been to the Buckhead Theater. That was really, really cool. And so now we're gonna head to this place called the White House to get brunch, I guess. Uh, it's like a cafe. And then right after that, right across the street is a Christmas market. And I am so excited because we're gonna German. do that. The German Christmas market? Oh, that's it, what they were talking about. Willkommen. We just finished with brunch. Brunchy brunch. And now we're gonna go to the Christmas market. I'm so, so excited. I don't know what to expect, but apparently it's a German Christmas market. And I went to Germany close to Christmas and it was really cool. Oh, there it is. So I can't wait to see if it's actually like Five it. bucks if I can guess exactly what Jacqueline is thinking right now. What? I know what I'm thinking. That you want dancing goat's cock. No, I was we thinking I want hot chocolate at the Christmas market. Oh. Ha 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 ha. You're close though. Oh, oh. Making our Christmas memories. I've been working so much lately. I can barely find the time to sleep. Yeah, I spend my time running around, keeping people pleased. But this is my favorite holiday. It's a chance to start over new. Cause I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you. These are the good times with you. Baby. Hi guys, so it is later in the afternoon. We are back from the Christmas market, all the grocery shopping, and it's already four o'clock, which is crazy. We are both so tired. I do not know why we're tired. I feel like it's just that Sunday mood where it's just like you go to church and then you just want to lazy around for the rest of the day. But we got our groceries done for this week, which is great. So I'm going to make dinner tonight. We're going to have pork chops. I actually haven't made that in our marriage, so I think we'll be good. And potato pancakes and I think Brussels sprouts as well. So I think I'm going to make a tea, kind of relax, and then we'll make dinner and continue our nice Sunday afternoon. going to take this eucalyptus and kind of split it up and tie it together and then I want to hang it in both our shower and then the guest shower because whenever it's dried and in the shower it just smells so good so I saw some eucalyptus at Trader Joe's and I grabbed some for that reason <laughs> snowman cookies um, I made a couple the other night but I'm just gonna make the rest oh wait for some reason those look like reindeer for a second these are so good they're the best I wanted the Christmas tree ones but they didn't have any so cue the cookie montage 